Shirley, what are you gonna miss most about Ed? Everything. <laughs> Just yeah. his quirky That's ways nice. that I <laughs> used to irritate the hell out of me, but I miss him now. <laughs> Probably that. And his sense of humor. On behalf of the President of the United States, the United States Army, and a grateful nation, please accept this flag as a symbol of our appreciation for your loved ones, honorable, and faithful service. Thank you. Those come from God. <laughs> they go from a higher commander, right? We're very sorry for your loss. Thank you. God bless you. May the Lord give you a very special gift. Thank you. Amen. On behalf of the Department of Veterans Affairs, Please accept this presidential memorial certificate in remembrance of your loved one's honorable and faithful service. I'm very sorry for your loss. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. And we're thankful. And we want to remember to be joyous and have faith that we will join him someday. Um, we've come here to dedicate um, and commit the ashes of Edward Farendorf. And in doing this, we recall that our bodies bear the imprint, the imprint of the first creation when they were fashioned from dust. But in faith, we remember, too, that by new creation, we also bear the image of Jesus, who was raised to glory, in confident hope that one day God will raise us and transform our mortal souls to live with him for eternity. So, Lord, Thank you for this day. Um, thank you for bringing everybody here and getting everybody here safely. People came from a long ways away on flights and, and drove long distances to get here. His grave site is number 500. He's the 500th veteran to be buried in this section as of today. One thing I love about my father was he never stayed angry at anybody, and that's a really good attribute to have. What are you going to miss most about Ed? Probably just our daily talks. He was very religious, very committed to God and Jesus. 